Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about showing you Angio Fibroma Imaging. Technology, it is a benign vascular non-encapsulated locally invasive mass originating in nasal cavity. Most common sign and symptom, unilateral nasal obstruction 90%. Epistasis 60%. Other signs and symptoms, nasal voice, nasal recharge, nanosmear, pain or swelling in checks, photosis, serous, otitis media. Demography, age range, 10 to 25 years recorded. Average age at onset, 15 years. Sex. Almost exclusive occurs in male patient. If found in female, may have genetic mosaism. Epidemiology. 0.5% of all head and neck neoplasm. Imaging. Center in posterior nasal County arising at sphenopalatine hormon extend into nasal pharynx, sphenoid sinus, geriacoid palatine fossa, masticator space, orbit scar base. CT finding in juvenile angiofibroma, heterogeneous visas to choose a bit enhancement. Bone remodeling and destruction. Posterior wall of maxillary sinus, bow anteriorly. Plus minus carpet inversion, intracranial extension. Upper finding in juvenile angiofibroma. Tubular signal, white on spin echo base sequence due to fast flow in a large vessel. Intent enhancement issues or heterogeneous. Angiography is typically performed at time of preoperative embolization, so tumor plus. Most common feeding entry into the muscular branch of external carotid artery. This is still common in a teenager. So, well defined mass with intra lesional flow voids, widening, widening the left PPF, deviating the posterior wall of maxillary sinus, and extending into left intracumbral fossa. T1C plus. FSMI in a 15 years old boy with nasal obstruction, so an enhancing juvenile angiofibroma, filling the left nasal cavity and extending into the nasal pharynx. The presumed size of origin is the SPF. Coronal contraction in CT, so a large. Junior angiofibroma is standing into nasal pharynx, infratemporal fossa, and middle cranial fossa. The sphenoid sinus is re replaced by the tumor. As seen in this case, the junior angiofibroma classically show a bit enhancement. Contraction in CT in the 13 years of male, so the type of growth patient of a large juvenile angiofibroma, including the nasal pharynx and extending into the right spinal sinus, middle cranial fossa, and masticator space. Anterior DSA during an external carotid artery injection, 
So then, hypervascular tumor, large, which is a large junior angular fibroma, fit by internal maxillary artery. Treatment, prefer complete surgical resection using preoperative embolization to decrease blood loss. Multiple surgical approach, open resection, which is endoscopic removal, plus minus laser assistant. Radiation therapy, L1 to surgical for antisexual intracranial disease and cavernous sinus involvement. Radiotherapy is used alone for cure in some institutions. Use with Caution in giant patient due to the potential to induce malignancy. Hormonal therapy, estrogen, is controversial. Low protein as computer secretion is not achieved. Feminization side effects of uh, and the recycle in adolescent male. Thank you.